Give me a, a progress report. How's your painting? This art professor. Tell me what is this? Is finding new ways to connect with his college students. Which door? The door to the microwave. What is wrong with you? Sometimes silly, but Scott Rayner hopes informative TikToks. So when you walk inside my office, right? That bring you into his classroom at High Point University. My students actually told me to uh, try it, and I was like, what's TikTok? I've never heard of that. That was three years ago. Since then, at Prof Scott Rayner has built up quite a following. Based on his art knowledge, yes, but also this big paintbrush. I looked at the phone and it had like 100 views and I was like, that's pretty good. <laughs> then it went to like into the thousands and then it went into the hundreds of thousands and then I started hitting into the millions of views. I don't know if you can grasp just how big this paintbrush is through scrolling on your phone, but I'm 5'4", you can see it's taller than me and Rainer says it's really more used as a big microphone for him to talk with other artists. That's one of the things I like to say in my TikToks is that the world needs artists. You know, we need to have you be an artist and make your art that I wanted to be a positive influence uh, within that realm of social media and for whatever reason this gigantic paintbrush gave me that voice. Somebody was like, hey, like, I think one of the professors is like kind of blowing up on TikTok. It also gives him a leg up with these college kids. And your mom is learning from my TikTok. Yes. Kinda. The constant dad jokes. <laughs> it was really cool to see like somebody in the older generation kind of connecting with us. But you know what? They go to him now for art and TikTok tips. I've learned the music helps mm -hmm. you go viral. It yeah. does. And why aren't you in uniform? They also tune in to his TikTok lives most nights. And then they'll come in the next day and they'll say in class, you know, tell me, so you posted something about impressionism. Can we talk about impressionism? And so I almost see TikTok as like an extension of my classroom. Rainer says he hopes to continue growing his platform of positivity and art inspiration, both on campus and on your screen. He's so funny to watch on TikTok, but to be with him in person is this whole other world that I feel really lucky to be a part of. I feel like I'm entering into their world, and, uh, and, and I'm doing okay in it. There's more to glazing than just donuts. In High Point, Jackie Pascal, WXII 12 News. And Rayner says that he loves the fact that unlike galleries where only maybe a few hundred people may be able to see his work, his TikTok live paintings get thousands of views from across the world, including his students right there who enter his classroom the next day. Rayner hopes that this does show those viewers the importance of daily practice and creativity. Pretty cool story there. And